Apex Casino's Buzz on Shaw. Your look at the complete entertainment scene is brought to you by the Apex Casino in St. Albert, located just minutes from Edmonton. Information available at apexcasino.ca. You're watching Buzz on Shaw TV. Hi there, and welcome to Apex Casino's Buzz on Shaw TV. I'm Brad Kelly on deck. We're going to be taking a look at this weekend's Oscar uh, contenders as we take a look at Best Director. Real time, we'll have that in just a few moments. But first, well, Alfred Hitchcock uh, was no stranger to the uh, Academy Awards, and one of his masterpieces has hit the stage at Mayfield Dinner Theater. The thrill ride, 39 Steps, promises to be a fast paced edge of your seat, who done it laugh fest. With that, the production will feature some dazzling set changes, which includes a plane crash. Wow. Here's more on the unforgettable show. I, I was right. He's double crossing you. Quick, now's your time. Through the window. Right. No, not that window. Well, which window? The rear window. Right. The 39 Steps was originally an Alfred Hitchcock film from 1935. Not too many of you will remember the film, but Mayfield Dinner Theater's production of the classic will be one you'll never forget. Throw in a dash of Monty Python in the mix, and you have a fast paced whodunit with a blend of spectacular performances and wildly inventive stagecraft. This two time Tony Award winner is packed with non-stop laughs. This was a big hit that started off in the West End of London and headed to Broadway afterward. It's a, it's a satire spoof of the Hitchcock movie 39 Steps, right? But it's not, it's not making fun of it by any means. It's, uh, they loved the movie so much and they wanted to see if they could put that movie with its huge cast of characters and put it on stage with only four people. And so, so having those kind of parameters, they, they then went about in an imaginative way trying to figure out how to how to put it on the stage. Director John Kirkpatrick makes his return to the Mayfield as does actor John Elliott. He plays title role Richard Hannay, a physically demanding role which Elliott makes look easy. One of the biggest reasons for Kirkpatrick's choice to play the lead. It's, it's all go like the the two guys come out of the beginning blow a whistle and literally it's it's a mad dash it's a it's a two hour marathon for us. Um, hopefully it doesn't look too uh, difficult for the audience like we're not too exhausted looking or <laughs> but um, I'm losing weight. I'm losing weight doing the thing so I'm pretty happy about it. Yeah, for being a kind of a physically demanding kind of a set yeah. uh, how does one as an actor prepare for something like this? Uh, well I've I've been having physio uh, before I started this show uh, on a bum knee that I've got and otherwise it's just we've we've had uh, as always here at the Mayfield the rehearsal period's quite brief so so it's you you've just got to really concentrate and uh, really um, build up your stamina which is where we're at like with the show right now one of the challenges staging 39 steps is the fact that there are so many set changes they're on a train they're running from police they're in uh, where are we right now we're on a train please please I'm trying to concentrate sorry as you can see yeah very involved Come along quietly, sir. Uh. It's really about um, audience imagination, actor imagination, creative imagination of how to put this, this journey of a man that goes from London to the moors of Scotland via train and, uh, and all the way back to London, how to put that onto a small stage evocatively and imaginatively and so that's you know that's the fun for the audience and that's the fun for us for creating it and maybe that imagination will help you digest the best buffet in town brad kelly shaw tv capital region